we should be good. I don't think we're going to overcook. We might overcook. Oh, don't burn. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Jeff, hit it. Welcome to the counselor's office. That's right. We're back in the counselor's office for some more Pokemon Emerald Hardcore Horlock. It wouldn't be a normal intro or outro if I didn't mumble fumble. We are back for some more Pokemon Emerald, the Hoenn Hardcore Nuzlocke. I said that all the way around, and that's okay. Because it was all the same. We're back. As you can see, we've got our team. Uh, very nice, very nice. Just an update. I don't know. I'm still recording. I recorded a bunch on January 1st, New Year's Day. And we beat, or at least we stopped, the cataclysm between Kyogre and Groundon. And now, here we are. We're going to continue on. We do have the 8th gym. But before I deal with that, can I even go in here? Oh, I can go in here. Okay, we're not going to... We're not going to face off against them. What we're going to do is two things. I don't, I don't think there's a really an encounter here. We're going to get a Relicanth for the utility. For the utility. Let's show my camera a little bit. For the utility of unlocking the doors. No, no, no. Oh, finally. Okay, cool. Oh, I was just watching YouTube for like three minutes or so. Finally, we got Relicanth. Let's go. It took long enough. I don't think, I don't think it usually Relicanth has high defense. So there's no way this gets one shot. Yeah, even the crit that did nothing. Okay, we do have to be careful about that. Not because we will kill ourselves, but because we don't want to kill it. And we're also not going to name it because remember it's just a, a it's just to get us to where we need to go. All right, dive ball. We're going to use this. We're going to I've got to remember cuz it's been a while since I've done opening the uh the Reggies. We will be able to have access to both Reggie Ice and Reggie um, oh, technically, we can also give up, because I said static encounters, we have to give up our first encounters, no, that's shiny, yeah, that's shiny, sorry, my bad, shiny, we can give up, static encounters has to be the first in the route, listen, I thought about it already, Okay, this is annoying. Just let me catch you. Just let me catch you. You're low health. I'm using a dive ball. It's on the ocean floor. There's no reason it should be taking this long to catch a relicamp. All right. Thank God, finally. Just go turbo mode and then say, screw it. 
All right, longevity Pokemon. Pokemon that was once believed to have been extinct. The species has not changed its form for one million years. It walks on the seafloor using its pectoral fins. Fun fact, this is actually based off a of real fish that is also an ancient fish. It's called the Silicanth. It is probably one of my favorite fish just because I like dinosaurs and history stuff. The uh, Silicanth is actually real. It's over by uh, Madagascar, I believe. And it's under the like sea caverns. Really cool. Fun fact, there's a little historical lesson for you Pokemon fans that these Pokemon are generally actually based off real things. Uh, unless you're talking about the dumpster trash Pokemon and they're just based off literal trash. Uh, some of the things that they, they that they come off are very creative and some of them are just not as creative. Let's just, let's be real of ourselves. All right. We're gonna lose some of our team for this and not like permanently, just temporarily. Cause we're gonna need to make two slots. Oh, it's evolving. It's crazy. Look how fast it's evolving. Wow. Moby is evolving. Wow. Crazy. It was actually level 26, so it took a minute for me to actually have to go through all that. That thing's massive. Moby evolved into whale lord. Don't mess with a giant whale. I'm actually curious because whale lord has a massive HP stat. Almost 200 at level 40. Prevents burns, which is very good. Uh, the only problem is I don't think it has a lot of physical attacks outside of rollout. But, I mean, it's a tank. Its defenses kind of suck. Its defenses suck, but... It'll serve its purpose. So we want Warlord in the front. Well, let's do that. Well, let's, let's do that in a minute. Wait, did I say Warlord? Waylord. Um, let's heal. Yes, I'm right here. I'm just too patient to wait for the, the tang. And now we're going on an adventure. We're exploring the rest of this map, and then we will have pretty much explored most of Hoenn. Now, if I remember correctly, you always want to stay in the middle. I'm not looking for battles right now. Like I said, I, I pro typically do not like water battles. Don't know why. It's just this game is all about water. There's too many water. There's like 40 something water Pokemon in this game. Oh, I missed it. It's right there. I need to be right there, I think. Yep. I need to go down. I'm too far up. I think I've already missed it. <sighs> I think it's going to throw me back down, right? I didn't mean to fight her. I meant to click the water. Oh, well, let's get her out of the way anyways, because she's just kind of blocking. Stone poison. Thank you. Oh, I should have used bite. Oh, well. Still achieve the same. Yeah, go ahead. Potion up, and I'm going to bite anyways. So dark type, still not as effective. I mean, they're neutral, but that's okay. All right, now let's just do this. Every time. Or am I being dumb? Does it not matter? Maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe this is how life is supposed to be. Yes? Okay. I'm going to save. Because I think I'm where I need to be. And yes, I will do the cheesy doodles where I can. I have to avoid it. Now, if I remember correctly, we need to go right here. That's okay. That's why we do this number. We reset the game because I, that's why we save. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's right here. Yes. Nope. One more. 
One more. Find, I accidentally, as a kid, I accidentally found this. I didn't find it legit because remember when you're a kid, the internet wasn't, was slowly taking off, but it wasn't as big as it is now. So I found this legitly by myself. And I even translated the Reggie symbols. I don't even know how I did that. But I did it as a kid. That's some big brain strats. Oh, because it was, it was Morse code. So Googling Morse code or was it Google? I think, was it Bing? I know it was like AOL and I went on AOL to find Morse codes. Yeah. And so I, I found this and it was such a cool freaking thing. And I was like, I love the, the, the whole the idea of this. Taking something that's in real life, like Morse code, and making it like mystical and something that people care about. Like, I don't even know what any of this says, but I could definitely look it up. Oh, that's right. We need to have our friends. And then Relicanth will be down here. And now... I need dig. Oh, no. I've underestimated my ability. All right, we're finally back. It spent 30 minutes trying to figure it out. But I forgot about that you need dig. But luckily, the Nakata we have for HM cut also can learn dig. So I leveled it up. And now we, we're going to use dig here, which is going to reveal a secret entrance. And this is where our friends come out to play. We have Moby, when they put Relicanth. And it's this really freaking cool room that's just like very creepy. And then you click this, you read the dialogue, and then the magic happens. I love this as a kid. It was so cool finding the secret out. Because the game really doesn't go out of its way to tell you this. It sounds as if a door opens some far away. Like, it doesn't. It really doesn't go out of its way to show you. Can you actually dig out of here? Yes, I want to leave. Cool. Yeah, the game doesn't at, does not at all go out of its way to show you... Whoa, that's not what I wanted. Whoops. doesn't go out of its way to show you like hey this is here the secret cavern is here and then all all these mystery signs and stuff again something else that isn't really shown so now we need to go get we need to get set up all right here we go we found it the island cave which is its own encounter Now, I do believe we have to do something specific to get everything open. All right, we have to do a clockwise lap. Clockwise. So we just go all the way around town. That's right, we're gonna go all the way around town. Maybe it's just this. Oh, no, we have to be against the wall this entire time, clockwise. Boom! There it is! We got it. All right. And there it is, Reggie Ice. Man, when I saw Reggie Ice for the first time, I was like, holy smokes. So we're going to go in hot because Reggie Ice is no slouch. The defense on this thing, our special defense, is pretty high. We might have Jolt come in. I have no idea. I think it's level 40. But ready or not, 
Here we go. It's an encounter. We want it. We got it. We got to catch it. All right. Here we go. Reggie Ice. Oh, baby. I think my initial... We should be able to tank that. Yes. Speed is already slow. That's fine. Attack. Special defense. I don't think that matters too much. Flame floor. Yeah, I don't. I thought I, I I thought it was gonna boost my special defense. But I don't think it matters. So we're just gonna go in for the damage. Koopa's gonna cook. Just don't burn. My only concern is the burn. Ooh, superpower. That's not good because it's gonna lower defense. Oh no. Just say defense, not special defense. Okay. I think we should be good. I don't think we're going to overcook. We might overcook. Oh, don't burn. Oh, my God. We got it perfect. Perfect. You could not ask for better. Now, I do have a Master Ball, but I'm saving that for Rayquaza because, I mean, let's be honest here. Now, we're hoping for the best. Ultra Ball, go! Dude, this music is hype. No! Oh, that was a crit, and I can't heal. We can take one more as long as we don't get crit. As long as we don't get hit, we, we'll be fine. Come on, Koopa. Hang in there. Yes. Two. Three. Yes! Let's go! That's the hypest thing. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Iceberg. Its entire body is made of Antarctic ice. That's crazy. After extensive studies, researchers believe that Ice Age was formed during an ice. Let's go. What do I, I want to? I want to call it ice. Um, Mr. Freeze. I love that. I love that, Mr. Freeze. Yes, Mr. Freeze. Nope, not numbers. Uh, Z. No. Z E. Mr. Freeze. Let's go. That's a fat W, and we didn't lose anyone. I'm so happy. Holy smokes. I remember doing that as a kid and taking forever. I had to reset, like, reset my save multiple times, is how bad that, that was. We have one more. That we can get. I almost want to fight Reggie Reggie Steel just to do it. You know, catch it to catch it, but not to actually use it. Just to feel the, I want the trifecta experience. Like Pokemon Emerald, I want to experience it in its whole. So that means catching even Reggie Reggie Steel. We, we can just call this the Reggie episode, and then Rayquaza can be next. All right, who, who, uh, Rock, I mean, Koopa, you're not doing anything here, so. We will put Doom in, on the team. Wait a minute! We can use Reggie still because the cave is a different location. It's not, it's a, it, it's a different, it's not, it's on the route, but it's a different location. It's a different named location, so technically we can. I don't know how, how, uh, like, let me see. Okay, a lot of people are saying it's just like the Nuzlocke forums are saying it's up to you what you consider uh, areas. Uh, lonely, I don't think is a good nature. 165 special defense though. This thing is cracked. With HP, like this is a, a special tank. Like this has, Mr. Freeze has to go on our team again, especially against the dragon. And it can learn th uh, Thunderbolt and Thunder. So we can use it against waters. Water type Pokemon. Koopa might actually die this episode. All right, we got at least we got some cash. I think that was enough to get a couple, to get an Ultra Ball or a couple of them. If I believe correctly, isn't there an HM? There is. Sandstorm. Let's go. 
Now, there's a bunch of, like, side activities we gotta do, like the, the battle tower. Now, let me figure out what this is. All right, so this is how you do it. I knew it. You had to go two and then two down. And then you use Rock Smash. Yes! I remember! I knew you had to do walk back somewhere. All right, we've got this, okay? Just remember for the future. I don't know if we're gonna have a, as clean of a battle as Reggie Ice. Reggie Rock, I, I remember you always being the pain in the butt. Always, for some reason, was the pain in the butt. So here we go. Let's go, Reggie Rock. You big boy. Now, I know he's specially defensive, so that's why we're doing Spark. Hopefully, they can get par Paralysis. Right off the rip. We love to see it, baby. That's only juice in the tank. Let's go. Okay. That's, that's kind of terrifying. Oh. I'm going to go for a bite because it is defensive. Woo! <laughs> I'm sorry. That was terrifying. All right. Just because I don't want to risk anything, we're going to Maki. Because Maki can literally avoid any, like, that can tank anything. Raise your attack, that's fine. Maki can handle it. Maki's got straight defense. I just wish I had something to increase my attack. We're not even going to risk it. We're just going to go straight into it. He is becoming a beefcake, which is terrifying. I do have a Master Ball as a panic button. If something's about to die and I don't want to die, then... Okay, that's fine. That's pro-typical. Now that... that this, that's going to do some damage. That's terrifying. That's actually terrifying. Just don't do that again. Just don't do that again, okay? We need Maki. Yes! We need to see more of that. All right, your red bar... You're very low red bar. You're in the danger zone. You're paralyzed. Give me a little jiggle jiggle. Yes, one. Okay. You, I don't like you. I hate that it knows curse. That's actually terrifying. If I knew something that could put it to sleep, I would use it to put it to sleep. Maki, hang in there. You're the only one that can tank this stuff. Why do you hate freedom? I can't really switch out to anything. Uh, Coral will die. Skipper might survive. Let's see. Skipper can, can maybe take something. Okay. You curse away. That's fine. Curse away. That's actually terrifying for me for every possible reason. The fact that you have massive attack. Because I should have been stacking up on bulk or something that maybe it would be a counterplay yes one two three yes oh my god i was my butt was tingling that was getting danger zone he was about to one shot something let's go rock peak pokemon a pokemon that is made entirely of rocks and boulders it's part of if parts of its body chip off in battle red rock repairs itself by adding new rocks I'm gonna call you Continent. Nah, that's what do I want to call you? Not Rocky. What I what do I want to call you? I'm gonna call you Goliath. Don't don't ask me why. Just he's a big boy. He's he's Goliath. There we go. Got Goliath. Add it to the list, baby. All right. Wait, no. Hold on, this is Desert Ruins. Technically, we also get a Desert Encounter, too. <laughs> technically, I get a Desert Encounter. I will remember that for later, because technically, by my own standards, I can get a Desert Encounter, because Desert Ruins is its own thing. Now, we go to Four Tree, because we have Reggie still over here. This is going to be a lot for me to edit, but this is going to be the Reggie episode for you all. If it's short or long or very edited, know that it is the Reggie episode. All right, here we are. 
the ancient tome. Now, I do know we need to be in the middle, and we need to use Flash. Luckily, we have Nakata that can do that. And here we go, baby! And we're going to ride into it. Now, Reggie still has high special defense and high, uh, physical defense. Not very good attack. So, we're going to hope that we can stall long enough to get, like, a paralyze or something, just like we did Reggie Rock. And we did not. But... It looks like we can do that a couple times. And Jolt can take a couple of hits because the attack's really not that good. Bingo! Bingo! That's what we wanted. That's what we wanted to see. All right, so he's gonna he's gonna raise his defense and attack, which is actually terrifying for me uh, that he's raising attack. Oh, we could take maybe one more of those, but he lowered his attack, so. Hey, can you take one more jolt without dying? You can. Perfect. Perfect. We love to see that. All right, now we just got to hope. We got the hope. Let's, look, we just got to make sure that we don't let jolt die like an idiot. All right. 46 ultra balls. Go. We do have a master ball as a panic button, but I really don't want to use it except for using a Rayquaza. Don't do this. Ancient power. All right. Again, I'm not going to risk it. I am going to go into Maki, who can take most of these attacks. I think superpower is one that it's really kind of going to do a little bit more damage. Metal claw, doesn't matter. Misses it. Perfect. Maki over here. Limber. Do dodging claw attacks. Why do you hate freedom? All right. Superpower, this should do, will probably do the most damage to Maki. Yes. Oh my god. Yeah, luckily we swapped out because uh, with a crit like that, I'm almost certain Jolt would have been dead. Normally, Maki would be able to take that if it wasn't for a crit. And crit crits ignore any uh, stat, stat drops. I believe the crits do. Maybe it's only on like defenses. I don't know. Oh, I may have to do turbo because this this Reggie still might be a little bit more annoying than the others. Oh my god. Thank you. Finally, we get a paralysis after all this time. Come on, let's get some RNG on our side. I mean, we've had some pretty good luck with the Reggie so far, but the catch rate can't be that ridiculously low with an ultra ball. Literally a, a a dot of health left in the para process. Yes, two. No, we can't even get past two. Come on. Come on. Maki, hang in there. We can't lose Maki. Maki's imperative we keep. Use all your ancient powers so I can go into um, Koopa. Because Koopa doesn't need to die. Two. Two. Oh, that was a crit. He got the quad. He got the Omni Boost. He, oh my god. this He just got the Omni Boost. I don't think it matters. It might matter. More damage is never good. All right, Koopa. You're the next big defensive thing here. All right, Koopa can take a superpower. Yeah, I, I figured so. Koopa, Koopa can take it. Let I'm summoning the Triforce to capture you. That's the nerdiest thing I've said. All right, we're just going to have to go turbo mode. This is going way longer than I want. Turbo mode. Another almost. Yep. No, it was so close. Are you kidding me? Why do you resist success? I'm the winning team, baby.
I'm the winning team. Come on, don't you want me? Yes, more paralysis, please. Oh, you're such a tease. Koopa, it would be a shame if you were to die to open up a slot. That would be such a shame. <gasps> ah! Why are you like this? That's two for two. But I'm okay because it's kind of balancing out with the fact that you're getting paralyzed a lot. A lot. That, that, that's, that works for me. Yes? No. Okay, Reggie still is kind of amping up, trying to get its attack balanced. Yes! I've, I've used almost, what, 20 balls already? Dude. Forget Reggie Rock being the one that's the hardest one to deal with. That was a, that turned out that was a lie. Yes! Oh my god, I thought we were gonna lose someone. <sighs> Iron Pokemon. Its body is harder than any other kind of metal. The body metal is composed of a mysterious substance. It's not only not only is it hard, it shrinks and stretches flexibly. Your Iron Man. I like how it's called the Steel. Reggie Steel. But it's actually made out of iron. Which is not the same. But okay. That's fine. Iron Man. Alright Iron Man. Go where are you supposed to go. Yeah. Oh my god. Let's go back and let's check out the group. We almost lost Maki. We almost lost several Pokemon if I wasn't playing smarter than I was. Let's go here because next episode we're going after Rayquaza. All right, let's look, take a look at the three Reggies. All right, we've got Iron Man. Sassy. Well, he was definitely sassy with me. Yeah, look at that. High defense and special defense. Attack is not bad, so it's it's usable. But what really shines here is the HP and the defense. Like, honestly, if we can get Toxic on this thing, or if I can figure out if Toxic's a TM... We could do we could do some stuff with Reggie Reggie Steel, like Reggie can take some hits, especially if I find some way to set up with it. Like this thing is a tank, and we could definitely utilize it on the team. We got Reggie Rock, we got Goliath, Relax Nature has significantly high defense, all right HP. Kind of high attack, not as high as I would like, but the defense is what shines on it. But it's a rock type, not very impressive, in my opinion. Then we have Mr. Freeze, which has high special defense and decent uh, defense with special attack. Like, but its special attack, its defense is nothing to caught, scoff at, but special attack is also very not like, eh. It's very, eh. Its HP is nice, though. But it's also an ice type that can also learn like Thunderbolt and stuff like that. So having an ice type might be advantageous for the Elite Four. We do have Dragon types and also having something that can take some special type attacks such as water attacks is good against the champion. We've got a lot of thinking because I would put both I would put both of these two on the team. But I don't know if having double Regis is the best optimal play. We will have to see. Especially if we don't get anything for uh Iron Man, if we don't get any, like, special, um, toxic stall moves, then Iron Man is significantly worse because it can't do anything. I'm Mr. Gaming Counselor. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. This has been the Reggie episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like I said, hit the like button. Comment down below, uh, your experiences with the Reggies and whether you had as much luck or bad luck, because Reggie still almost killed me, uh, as I did. As always, hit the like button. Comment down below. And, uh... Don't forget to be the best version of yourself and game out. Huzzah!